Hello friends, welcome to the toothcorner.com with news. Today let us know more about lectins and find out how to remove lectins from tomatoes and the amount of lectins present in the vegetable. Let us begin. Tomatoes form the main part of the meal on an everyday basis. It would be hard to think about a meal without using it. You may either use it in your favorite salads or in your fries. The concerning topic is the presence of lectins in it and its harmful effects. Now firstly let us find out what are lectins. Lectins are proteins that bind with carbohydrate or sugar. It is usually harmful for human beings when consumed in high quantities. Lectins are present in many vegetables and legumes and may be detrimental to those who are allergic to the same. You need to maintain the portion control to avoid the harmful effects of overconsumption. Now let us see the amount of lectins in tomatoes. Tomatoes indeed have lectins but the proportion is quite low. So it is not dangerous to have the same in small quantities in everyday diet. You need to be cautious only if you are allergic to lectins or have poor digestive habits. Now let us see how to remove lectins from tomatoes. The amount of lectins present in tomatoes is low and will not have any ill effects on you. But if you want to remove it, follow these simple steps. Firstly, take the necessary quantity of tomatoes. Wash them well. Add to a pan and pour sufficient water. Boil at a high temperature for at least 10 minutes to decompose the lectins. Cool them in cold water and slowly peel and remove the skin. Remove the seeds that will thoroughly feed the tomatoes from lectins. Now the tomatoes are entirely free without lectins to which you are allergic and you may consume the same without any detrimental effects. Thank you.